Boob was itching? <laughs> well, that happens, I'm told. It's like, <laughs> I've it never happens. been told that. <laughs> I mean, I guess I guess that's one of those things where you could assume that it happens, but um, it's annoying as hell. I can imagine that is true. I don't know. I mean, I guess it's my like boob I'm just issues walk around it, scratching issues, my boob. Itches. Of, people might pay to see that. I don't think. <laughs> maybe we should have uh, promoted that during the actual show. And that's just not gonna, if you would like to donate a. <laughs> Patreon.com slash Atheist Airwaves. Watch Courtney scratch her boob. <laughs> we'll make a GIF. It's a GIF. It's a GIF. Fuck We've fuck. already gone through this. Definitely yes. a GIF. Oh, you. Thank you. What? GIF or GIF? GIF. Thank no, you. It's GIF. <laughs> we're, we're locked. We need no. a third the, party. the man who created Can it. Can we ask the cat? The what? man who created it says GIF. The man who created it is not a linguist. It's 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 old. Man. It's this his. Is, this is I don't get anybody a shit. who's been doing this since the start knows right. it's a GIF. What? It's because you guys are you guys, no. you guys too are, young. You guys are this it's a old. It's fucking GIF. Okay. <laughs> it's, a, it's a GIF. You're oh, wrong. I'm sorry. When you're talking about going back to Napster days, how old were you? Forty? You and your Napster? vinyl. Napster. <laughs> 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 How old do you think I am? <laughs> Based on your pronunciation of GIF, you're about 82. <laughs> 40. All right, so let's talk about strippers first. Okay, so why same. are you against strippers? Because, like, I know... Bad experiences. Okay, like like what? <clears throat> um, fuck. <laughs> I, um, I spent... I was underage, and I spent about three months... Not living, but every day, just about five to six days a week, in a strip club. Not 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 as a patron. Just hanging out. Not, yeah, okay. I was I was in the 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 back of the strip club. I guess. I mean, I was inside the building, but I wasn't like where all the customers were watching girls dance. It, and I saw shit, man. Oh, I, I I saw shit, and then I saw actual shit. But oh. I mean, okay, so they like, had what kind of stuff are you talking about? They had private rooms. Right. Okay. That aren't so private if you know if you. you they Where have, is this? What, can, can you tell what town this is? Arlington. Arlington, Arlington Texas. Arlington, Texas. Okay. Mm-hmm. Fantasy Ranch. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. Um, so in these so-called private rooms, they have to have some sort of security. Most clubs, from what I understand, have bouncers that you can't really see the bouncer if you're the if you're the the guy getting a dance or whatever, okay. but there's mirrors in such a way that they can see what's going on, but the guy isn't distracted by mm-hmm. seeing you know the bouncer stand over there. Sure. Well, this this particular setup was cameras, and they had cameras with it was closed caption cameras, and if you were in the back room, you could watch what the fuck was going on in the private rooms. And strippers, at least the ones there, will do just about anything if you've got money. Sure. And that's why you're against strippers because well, you don't like sex workers. What? That's what it sounds like. No, I'm, yeah. I'm okay with sex workers. I'm okay with that. So then, what, I just, is, what are you well, saying? Well, there's the, there's that. There's the the fact that I've seen just horrendous things, and I really don't have any desire to be around strippers. Although not all strippers do that. Not all strippers do that. Well, but what's I just wrong have with, a bad well, okay, taste in my mouth. What, what's I've wrong with doing seen, that though? I've I've also, well, well, because I feel like I feel like this is another one of those things where you're like completely emotionally invested in this thing, well, but you have not engaged intellectually at all. No, I have engaged intellectually. Because and I've heard yes. you... No, because I've heard you <laughs> say that you're okay with sex workers before. Totally okay and now with sex certain, workers. And now you're not. I'm just... The memories of the grossness are totally, totally an emotional <laughs> thing, dude. Totally an emotional thing. So you Jay say the word stripper. When you say the word stripper, things come to mind that I don't want to see. Um, so the, there's the other aspect of it. Okay, if, if one instance that was just absolutely d- despicable, and again, not all strippers do this, but I saw several do similar things. There was a guy who was in his late sixties, early sixties, somewhere in there, and sexy. He, what? <laughs> <laughs> he, uh, his wife had just died, and he had retired, and he was a lonely old man. So he started going to the strip club. And he wanted sexual companionship, and he just wanted companionship in general. And I watched two different strippers drain his entire savings dry in the course of about a month. Well, and it's his own stupid fault. But people that can do that—but this is really weird for me. I'm having like such cognitive dissonance right now because, like, you've told 
You've said on this show repeatedly, if they're stupid enough, I agree. To he's do an idiot. It. He's a total fucking idiot. But now you're like completely offended by it. So how do you? So this might be a good segue into our utilitarianism thing because okay. I don't think you have a moral system. I think you just react to shit. <laughs> I think you just make it up as you go, and you make a lot of mistakes because of that. Um, well, I mean, I, I do make things up based on my interactions with them, and I make decisions based on you know the situation at hand because I haven't encountered it before, so I'm not exactly. In- Right, but I mean, if you if you know what your morality is based on, you have something, you have a guidepost to tell you how to react to new situations. I mean, sure. I've I've never been in the situation you're talking about. I'm, I'm, I'm completely against watching this happen to people. It's like I no 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 no. I like I think you're right that it's immoral what you're describing. It's fucked up. It's, it's, well, it's, 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 but it's, you have you have it's completely within their realm of of capability, and it's not illegal. They were both consenting. It, oh, I think it could be illegal. Yeah, I think I think in this case it is. I think that there are plenty of other cases when it's not. How is it, how is it illegal? Well, well, if 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 it's trading, uh, it, it wasn't how sex. Far it goes. He never it's, got laid. It, he just he just went in and laid up. He was lots, trying lots to get money. laid, but he was stupid. Uh. And it, it's. It was sad to watch it happen, and it was. But you, you can. I you mean, can if make someone's that taking, choice. if you're, if, you're, you if someone is taking advantage of you, I mean, like you know, he wasn't. He he was able. I mean, I've seen that in probate court. Was, I've seen it in probate court where they've said, you know, this person was taking advantage of that person, and that's why well, this sure. happened. And but he was he was willingly going to this place. He was willingly doing this. It wasn't like he was coerced into it. And 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 he was capable enough to do it. Yeah, and make the choice. Yeah, I he mean, wasn't. He wasn't mentally, mentally impaired at all. Yeah, yeah then, I mean, then that's his choice. I had conversations with the guy. I knew him fairly well. He actually used to work for the airlines and bought me a fucking plane ticket, but that's a different story. You are a bad person. Uh, I Rebel, didn't actually use the plane ticket. He, Rebel, he Rebel 1852 in the chat room makes a really good point. What's he that? says, you are okay with dumb people doing dumb stuff, except for this one dumb guy. And this guy no, you have I'm, a problem with. I'm, I'm, no, I Why? Don't, I don't have a problem with him doing it. It was stupid and it was sad to watch, but it's completely and totally but within... You, but you think that 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 is moral what those trippers did to him? No, I don't think it's moral. But you've said that before that if you're stupid enough to fall fall for this, that you deserve whatever. Oh, he did deserve it. Absolutely, he was a fucking idiot. But it was sad to watch. And people that can do that willingly will do that to that human being. I, I don't we want to be around a, those people. I really thought we were going to make it through with you tonight, but I don't think we are. I don't. I don't want to be around those people. <laughs> no, I, I I don't blame you. But I mean, I, I it just, doesn't make it moral or immoral. You're I like, just don't want to be around them. Well, then why wouldn't you want to, What is it about it that, that you don't want to be around? I don't want to be around a person who's going to do that to another person. Because? They're shitty people. Because? They're taking advantage of the dude. And that is? Shitty. <laughs> <laughs> it's but immoral. It's not immoral, no. It is immoral. It's not immoral. Sure Well, is. then it's not shitty. I it think it, it's it's immoral to be shitty to people, but not okay, like you okay, say. Okay, you're right. Not it, all it is, not all immoral. strippers are going to be immoral in that way. <sighs> it is immoral. Yes, he, he said, but there right. are plenty of other <laughs> people who are not strippers who are immoral in that way. Yeah, I happen mm-hmm. to practice in a field that <laughs> has a lot of really <laughs> shitty people. It's, it's a generalization. I am attaching that generalization to an entire category of, right. of people, and it's unfair and it's not right. But I, I just get the fucking willies when I think of strippers because uh, I spent three months. And a lot that of shit. people get the willies when they think of attorneys. And there's oh, a good a reason for it. <laughs> <laughs> you brought up the willies, man. <laughs> Don't bring up my willie. Okay. But taking advantage of people is immoral. Yes? Depends on the situation. Okay, give me in a situation where taking advantage of someone is a, the moral act. Is a moral act. Is a moral act? Yes. I don't know that there is any situation wherein it's a moral act. So, is it immoral to, for, for them to take advantage of it? I don't think it's necessarily immoral because he is allowing it. He's a fucking idiot. Well, right, but he's being taken advantage of. He's being scammed, basically. Well... I, I don't know for fact I mean, that he didn't want that. I mean, to he quote, was to quote. I think it's he kept coming in and doing it. I think it's it's Chris Rock who once said, "There is no sex in the champagne room," and I mean we can't all be philosophers of the uh, level that Chris Rock is. We can't all be that kind of big thinker. <laughs> 
And so for those of us who don't understand that there's no sex in the champagne room. <laughs> The fuck? <laughs> I'm just saying they're taking they're they're basically lying to him to get his money. They were leading him on, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, they're lying to him to get his money. That's immoral. Okay, I agree. You're you're right. It is immoral for for that to happen. And this is why I think having a rational basis it's for morality, illegal, it could be. It depends on what they did, but it. Could I don't be. think it should be illegal. I would disagree with you, but let's <laughs> let's not get sidetracked there. Because okay. where I want to go is okay. this is the... You want to go to the champagne room with me? Yes. It, wait, <laughs> is there sex in the champagne room? I can't remember. <laughs> um, uh, wow, there's a whole bunch of uh, exclamation points in the chat room. Okay. <laughs> it's immoral. Okay, so... Um, it's a plane. I know. It's like that's the first time we've had a plane interrupt the show since we left Flower Bluff that's Studios. A, that's a big plane. <laughs> it's a C-130 probably. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> um, this is why having a rational basis for your morality is so important because uh, you don't make stupid mistakes like you just made. If you, well, no, you do. You do make stupid mistakes because we're all human. What right? stupid mistake did I just make? You have no idea that lying to people to steal their money is immoral until just now. No, it's not right. And what, what? Right, now you know that. But oh, fuck you. It's like I didn't know that before. <laughs> you didn't know that before. You have argued repeatedly on this show that, that, that if people are stupid enough to fall for <laughs> stupid tricks, that they deserve to have their money taken. They do. No. No, it's immoral. Just because it's immoral doesn't mean they don't fucking deserve it. Okay, but you said <laughs> er, you said earlier that it, it's that immoral. It was not immoral. You said it was not immoral, and then you agreed that it was. Okay, I, so I, I agree. Not, it, it is it is immoral for the strippers to take advantage of him. Yes. Does he deserve it? If he's that fucking dumb, yeah. No, because yes. being dumb is if you allow yourself to be taken advantage of by allowing. an immoral. He's not smart immoral enough person. to prevent it. He's not smart enough to prevent it, and they are not ethical enough it's like to being not robbed. do it. It's like it's like being robbed. Okay, if I oh, were to, okay, man, hold on. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go here for a second. So if I were robbed. Okay, then it is my fucking fault for not no, preventing that to no, some degree. Yes, no, it is. Don't victim blame. Is. Don't victim blame on my show. No. <laughs> and this, this, this is this is what I apply to myself. Robbers should not rob people. I agree. People, However, people do not deserve to be robbed, no matter what they do. That's not true. Yes, it is. No, no, no matter no. what they do. No matter what they no do, matter they what do, do yeah, not you deserve, deserve to be robbed. robbed. You don't deserve to be raped. No. You don't okay. deserve any of that. Deserve is a bad word for it. Yes, right. it is. You're right. I, I, okay, I'll agree with you on that. Uh, you're so not can, can asking just, to be robbed. You're we, not asking to be robbed. No, you're, you're right. But okay, I apply this can to myself. Just skip, I apply can, this, we skip to, can we skip to the end where you just agree that we're right about everything? Because that's where it's we're going. It's not going to happen. Okay. Do it only is. <laughs> I think we're speaking two different things here yet again. No, we're not. Immorally, <laughs> immoral versus illegal versus does he fucking deserve it or she deserve it. Okay, so if, if someone were to rob me and I apply this okay. to myself. I did okay, not, tell me, tell me, because I'm gonna act on what you tell me here. If I did not, <laughs> you okay Sorry, there? Boob mic. If if, <laughs> my, if I did not do enough things to prevent someone from robbing me, <laughs> oh, dude, <laughs> what, dude, dude, what? Total victim blaming. Yeah, I, okay, is, I'm victim blaming myself. Then no, this is this 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 well, goes straight. I, I the, the, this this feeds right into the blaming somebody for being yeah. raped. No, yes. no, no, it's no, no, the no, same no, thing. No, 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 it's, it's, totally, it's, the it's same. not no. the same thing because it's a completely different fucking situation. No, it's yeah. the same if, thing. It's something bad happening to you, and you're blaming the person that something bad happened to. Because I could prevent instead of in, yes, yes, exactly. So stop what you're talking about because that's exactly what you're doing. I agree with you. That's exactly what you're doing. You're victim blaming, and you can apply exactly what you're saying to rape victims. Which and I think it's, it's clearer it's a different to you. Situation. It's a different situation. How is it different? Because someone's was different. raping someone versus, okay, how, how versus are Versus what? Raping just yeah. seems more wrong to you. Right. No, what is, is what more are you wrong? No, but it's see, still something it's still that's immoral. On a sliding scale of, of no, wrong, no, no, yes, no. it is more wrong. But, but, but that has nothing to do no, with whether the victim is to blame for the wrongness. I feel like but, I would be at fault. I mean, not completely. Obviously, we share that fucking blame because you came in to rob me. But if my defenses okay. weren't such that you could get through them Can to I, get my shit... So if so I'm like if I'm like a ninja, then you deserve it. So like if I can if I have you bested skills, me. And so let me say this. If you I'm bested like, me. So like if I can grab you by the ponytail, bend you over, and 
boom, and you and you're not good enough to stop me. What does boom mean? Like <laughs> rape me? Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> then a, then you deserve it. No, that's a different fucking situation. It was no, out, no, it was out of a, your control. This is it was out of your control. But is that what you're just saying that no. if the other person is okay? You should have been prepared, you right? Should, you, you shouldn't have allowed yourself to get in that situation, maybe, but even oh, then. Oh, but dude, even dude, then. Dude, dude, we have to stop. We have to stop. Okay. Whoa, 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 no, no, no. Whoa. Time out. Time out. Time out. Time out. Time out. I'm, I'm not, no, 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 I'm not fucking victim blaming. Yes, you are. When so, it comes please, to rape please, versus please, please theft, stop. it's a totally it's different the same game. Thing. Because it's the same thing. No, it's, it's not. Thing. No, it's not time the time same time fucking thing. It's not the same thing, Christian. Back back me up, Trevor. Okay. It's not the fucking same thing. It is the same thing. No, it's not. You're talking about two crimes, and you're saying... And you're saying that if you don't prevent one, you're to blame. And if you don't take precautions to stop the other one, you're not. You're not. So let me just say, can I pet? What, how do I How do I get? I'm shutting up so I, you can make your point so I can understand. I'm just better. saying, how do I get um, you to not be defensive about it? How do I get How do I get smart J back? Do I need to give you pills? Or <laughs> maybe you can take a, a hit Sm- off your, your vape there. Because, because I mean, it's the same I, thing. I understand the principle that you're saying. Okay. But I, I but see what's the two, difference? Just I tell see, me the difference. I see it as two different things. The Why? difference is when you, when it comes to being robbed, like your house being robbed, you have time before you move in. Now, if you move, if, if you fucking move in and you don't do anything to secure your shit, then you are you at don't fault do, for allowing no, someone to walk in your no, fucking house the and take your shit. The person who robbed you Granted, is at fault. They have fault as well. No, 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 no. I do not have fault for leaving something where someone can you steal it. You know you live in a society wherein that's a that's a potential yes. threat. Yes. Okay, so that you're going to... That does not mean that I am to blame you can. You're going to do for someone stealing. That person is to blame for stealing my stuff. They share... They, they have the vast majority of the blame. I absolutely agree. Absolutely. They have all of the blame because they no. did it. No, because they came to my house and... Was I felt- wise for for leaving my stuff out in the open? Probably not, but it doesn't mean I deserve it. It doesn't mean again. I'm not saying you deserve it. Doesn't it. mean I have any. Again, I'm not saying you deserve it. it but you share I, part no, of the blame. No, yes, you do. No. no. Yes, you fucking do. I'm good at this proportional responsibility thing, man, and that's not where the blame lies. No, there, it's, if, if, it's it's not a blame thing. If you leave your front door unlocked, you're not partially to blame for no, somebody walking no. in there and taking your shit. No. No. You're not to blame at all. People don't walk knowing in. that knowing that that's a potential here's, possibility. No, here's, you're wrong. No, here's what would have to happen for that to be a thing. It would have to be common behavior for you to go up and try a door, and if it's open, it's okay to go in. Then yes. Then you you would be no. Deployed. It's not. It's not okay to go in. But you know right. that there is the potential for that to happen. That so does that make you, you to take blame? Preca- if you don't take no. precaution against that, then you do share a portion. We of have that to blame. talk about something. No, you do not. Yes, and you do. You How are, do you not share a portion of that blame? Because, if you know because it, because you're not happen. a criminal. Leaving your door I'm unlocked not saying it's is criminal. not a crime. I'm not saying it's criminal. Then how can you share the blame in a crime? I'm not saying you share the blame in a legal That's court of what justice. You, That's not at all what I'm saying. What you're say- we're talking about a crime. And you're yes. saying you I share responsibility for the crime if, if I do something like leave my door unlocked. If I leave my door unlocked. That's horse shit. No, it's not. I know that it is a potential okay. possibility that someone could walk to my house and... Raise your hand if you think that leaving your door unlocked makes you an accessory to a crime. I never said it makes you an accessory to a crime. You're taking a legal <laughs> it makes no, you you're taking a legal responsibility stance. for it. Yeah, but not on a legal basis. I'm but not just, saying that you're just, legally on, fucking on, liable on, for on, it. On a moral basis? Perhaps that's the, the, the right phrase, moral basis. I don't know. I've never okay, tried to Okay, raise it. your hand if you think leaving your door unlocked is immoral. Immoral? No, that's it's what not. Just a, no, I'm saying that you share part of the fucking responsibility there in that you could have done something <laughs> to prevent it to a certain degree. <laughs> Prim Laura in the chat room just says, life is an RPG, apparently. <laughs> I get that joke. <laughs> I'm a nerd. I get it. <laughs> you, you don't think that knowing in the society in which we live that someone could walk up to your house and try to rob you, just leaving your door unlocked does not give you some part of the fucking blame. No. Okay, well, we're just going to disagree on that. We're because just going I don't, to. I don't blame I, I, victims. I, I blame criminals. I think where Christian was going at it was the right way. It might not be the wisest thing to do to, okay. to do that. But I'm not responsible for the fact because I've done this very recently. I had a weed eater I was working on and I left it out in my carport. Mm-hmm. And I left it where it was visible if you were in the house over where they were actually doing construction and stuff. Mm-hmm. You could see over because it was just a chain link. It's the only part of my sure. my house where you can actually see over and into 
where my carport area is, and there were people there working. I don't know that they're the ones who actually took it. Sure. But in the years that I've lived in this house, I've left many, many things out. This sure. just happened to be a pretty nice weed eater. Mm-hmm. And, and I had been working trying to get it, you know, sure. nice and, and tuned sure, up. Sure. And it was sitting out there, and it was sitting out there for about three days, and it totally disappeared. And it doesn't make you moral or immoral. It's, it's, not, an, right. a, it's not a moral scale. That comes into play when the person who just decided to take it that's that's their moral issue. I'm not saying it's a moral sure. issue. I'm not saying that you have legal responsibility or moral responsibility. I'm saying that you do have some responsibility for your own shit, whether that be leaving your house unlocked, leaving something out there. Right. It's but it's not it's not a proportional share of the responsibility for the crime. It, no, no, it was criminally. Oh, no, it, absolutely it, or not. Right. Morally. Or morally, or morally. Okay. I and agree. and it wasn't a wise choice for me. To leave it there it was when I did fucking that. stupid. I mean, uh, knowing that the possibility was there. Right. Well, and 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 there's a reason that I didn't expect it because sure. I lived in that house. You for were years. conditioned. I actually have other tools that were worth more than that mm. sitting out. This was just a plum one, and it was orange. And you, you know, were you were conditioned something... to expect that it wouldn't be stolen. Right. Right. I understand and, that. But but still, I should have. I, if I had tucked this behind even a little bit further, probably wouldn't you have. Could have but taken it was some sitting there. It could have been seen. I probably still would have left it out in the court report and it wouldn't have been stolen. It just happened to be sitting at an angle where it was real easy to see if you happen to be doing work like the house over. Right. You know? And, sure. and, and that's why it, why it was taken. You are not to blame for that. The person who stole it is to blame for that. Yes. He could have made a decision that, that would have kept it from being doesn't stolen. Ma- doesn't matter. No, it does matter. And, 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 and there's, there, there, there were safer ways that I could have done it. But I shouldn't have to put it in a safe... Because guess what? Somebody could have just as easily opened up the window. Sure, absolutely. So, so to my house, the chat room is making that. the same. Absolutely. The chat room is making the same point I was. You streamer two four nine five nine eight says so. If I wear a sexy outfit, I'm partly to blame for being raped. No, I don't. I don't agree with so that. What's the difference? You take some precautions in a world in which you know there is the the chance for something bad to happen to you. You don't. So you don't. If you so you so you think that you would share in the blame if you went to a particular uh, situation wearing a sexy outfit? You think that you should be partially to blame for your? If rape? you didn't take precautions, that be very careful. Think no, about I what am. you're about to I, say. I, I am. If you didn't take precautions and you knowingly walked into a situation wherein that was a potential hazard, knowing that was a potential hazard, that's a problem. Is that to say that we should so live in a world? No, hold on, hold on. Does that mean that we should live in a world that it's a good thing we live in a world where that's a possibility? Absolutely fucking not. I'm not, and it's not accusing you of and saying that. And it's and it's not vain. And it's not the, it's not that person's fault that they were raped. It's they have no legal fucking responsibility. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now they have you're no talking moral about, responsibility. No, whoa, no, that's where you were going with it. Is no. you know, you were saying it's a crime, right? No, that's not what I was saying. That's what you were saying earlier. No, what I'm saying, yeah. no, it is a crime, right? It is a crime. Okay, okay. And, and that's what I'm saying. So we're clear. Is that, is that it doesn't mean that you share any legal responsibility, but personal responsibility, perhaps some. Yes, there are always situations that are going to be out of your control, without a doubt. Okay. And that doesn't mean that you're if you if you're in a situation that is without your control. You. Uh, so, but what you're telling me, if I understand this correctly, mm-hmm. before, I, before, before I have to freak out, that you think that there are situations in which you are partially responsible for being raped. That there, you if can... You knowingly... You, you go to... Oh, you, oh, yes. No, that's what I'm, if you knowingly... Dude, it's please, a stop, situation. please stop, please stop. Or you don't please. want me to answer. No, I don't want you to answer. Okay, well, I really don't. Because I, I don't think you're think you I don't do think that, because you were you were loath to you were loath to say this before and now you're you're pretty much willingly saying it and I think it's because you feel like you're backed up logically against the wall and you are cognitive dissonance. Yes. This is what it this feels is what it looks like. like. Yeah. I, I I do completely I'm not changing my stance on this at all because you, need you do share some responsibility no. if you knowingly walk into a situation if someone else commits a caution if someone else commits a crime they are totally responsible for it i totally legally absolutely no 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 no. hold on legally absolutely morally absolutely for a personal responsibility standpoint you share some blame no yes you do no you You absolutely fucking do if you had some control over the situation what is the difference if you had some control over the situation no 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 you don't you could and you could have done something to prevent it how no 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 whoa 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 
if you could have, if you knowingly walk into a situation where you know you could have done something to prevent that situation, I'm not saying that you are completely to fucking blame. Someone in the chat room calling yell at Jay because I what are you calling yell at me. It's not going to change my opinion on the matter. It's personal responsibility. I know it, it will eventually. It's radical self fucking reliance. It's personal no. responsibility. It absolutely is. No. It's the same thing with theft. Taking care of yourself is not the same thing as being responsible for other people's actions. You can't always you be responsible not, for some. For you other are people's not no. in any way. But you can. Zero ways are you responsible for someone robbing you, for someone beating you, for someone killing you, for some. Well, killing maybe. But <laughs> <laughs> for someone, what's the difference? What's the difference? Because because you self could, defense. Some people just have self to defense. die. Okay, so that's fair. If you attack someone. You can be responsible for someone killing you. You are never responsible for someone raping you. Ever. It's morally Ab- absolutely Ab- no, not. No, 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 no. Stop no. saying that. In any sense, you are never. I disagree. Oh, dude. I disagree because there are some levels of personal responsibility that you can control. There's many that you can't. But there are circumstances in which you knowingly are going into a situation you, where that is a risk. These, That's a high-risk situation. What does that have to do with whether you're responsible personal responsibility. for being raped? You know that the you world know, acts like You this. know that you don't believe this. I don't know why you're saying it, but you know you don't believe you know that, that you rape victims are responsible for their I'm own fucking rapes. I'm not saying rape victims are you responsible. You just said that! No, Christian, if... Can, can, can everybody take these actions to protect themselves from rape? Can everyone take these actions to present, protect themselves from rape? Altar boys? That's a good point. They shouldn't have been That's wearing... That's a good point. That's a good point. They should yeah. not have been wearing those revealing robes. It, it, it has very little ones, to do with revealing had, robes or clothing wear, or anything you, like that. You, you could wear like the, the red ones or the gold ones. They were probably wearing the gold ones. Okay, if you're walking, let's talk about this in scenarios because I'm not. I think what you guys are. I think what you guys are, are hearing me say <laughs> but, is but not what I'm not, saying. But there's not a scenario here where it works. It doesn't no, matter it does. how capable you are. There's somebody that is more capable than you. That's true. Okay. That's absolutely true. And no matter how. That doesn't mean it's not wrong. Are, right. Right. We're not arguing that. It's 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 just a matter of there's 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 no way that that you can count I, that the solution for preventing rape. Is for just don't to, fucking rape to not fucking rape. Don't rape. Exactly. I absolutely and that's, wholeheartedly that's, agree. That's, that's what you're all saying. There is to it. No, no. that's the end of the. That's the you, end of the conversation. You, you, that's you know. where it has to stop. And that's you that's, also that's shouldn't. Where the you also shouldn't steal. No. You also shouldn't yes. kill. You also True. shouldn't do all this. But you do know True. that we live in a world where those things take place. So you take as many no precautions responsibility as you can. for no. what other people choose to do. You have none. If I walk down. Into, yes. Okay. You have so no responsibility in that I, case. If, I don't care where you're walking. If if I'm or walking, what you're doing. If I'm walking into East St. Louis. Yep. Okay. In the middle of the night, you do not with, share any responsibility. Oh, in your I absolutely own fucking do. You, I absolutely do. No, you if do not. If I knowingly walk into a high risk situation without taking the precautions to present myself from being killed, no. I do share some of that responsibility no, you don't. because I, because if I had the ability to prevent myself from being in that situation and I did it anyway. Yeah, I share some of that responsibility. I could have made a better decision there. It's not swimming in a shark tank, man. It's not. Yeah. You, you you don't have to count on crime. It's not something that should ever be the case. You shouldn't have in to count on crime. I agree. Responsibility. I completely it's, agree. You don't. It's not something that, that should be foreseeable. That, it is though. It is. We live in a world where those things do take place. Sure. They're never not going to take place. Right. People are always going to be people, and people are going to do shitty right. things to other and people. And those people are responsible for those shitty things. You are not responsible for a shitty thing that someone else chooses to do to you, no matter what you're doing. There I don't are care. many circumstances. I don't, don't care if you walk naked down the street. You do not deserve. You to should be not be raped. You do not deserve to be raped. I completely and totally you are agree not with responsible that. for you your own rape. If you could have prevented. No, that. no, stop right there. No, just it, stop no. saying it. Well, I'm telling you, stop saying it. I'm not going to stop disagreeing with. I'm not. I'm not going to because I. You need wholeheartedly to. feel that if you had some way, knowingly to prevent that, and you walked into it any fucking way, yes, you do share some of that responsibility. No, absolutely. How can you? How can you share responsibility as someone who's not? Because you crime? knowingly walked into a situation. That you knew that was a very distinct possibility. I'm yeah. not saying that every single situation is like this. That, that doesn't. You still do not assume responsibility for the actions of other people. You don't assume most of the responsibility, you don't but you do. Any you of you it. do. You do. You take a, a small portion of that responsibility. Yeah. You absolutely not do. unless you do some proactive action. Not unless like walking down the fucking street into a bad no, neighborhood like in the middle of the night, pulling a gun on someone else, and then you get shot. 
you share some responsibility. You share way more responsibility. No, but you, you share you, some. But but but, but knowing but there, that, that was but a, there but there where you pull the gun on somebody else, you're being more prepared, or at least <laughs> considering that that's a possibility. Well, it depends on the situation. Why are you pulling a gun on someone else? Are you being well, the aggressor or not? Well, maybe because they're about to rape you. Okay, then I, and you pull out the gun and then you get shot and then it's your fault because you. If you uh, took every possible there's, precaution there's, that there's, you could. But but no, it's 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 still you're you're yeah. you're you're blaming a victim and that's just can't you Don't can't do, do it. Don't I, do it. I think I that's, think that's, that, that's that's a step over that you can't really do, man. Yeah, it's, well, I, I that's how I there believe. Was, there was someone, that's how I see the world is you know that there are wrong. you know that there are dangers out there. And if you can take the precaution and you don't, then yes, you share part of the responsibility. Absolutely. You're wrong. Well, call D- me wrong all you want. D E D M A N C H A N at gmail.com. Please don't send me your hate mail. Send it to this asshole. I would much rather have received my own hate mail so I can actually read it and respond to it. I would much rather you receive it too. Um, and you deserve it because you can this, believe that all you want. You, dude, I, I, dude, I'm going to believe the way I believe. You're blaming it's, rape victims for their own rape. No. And you deserve, you deserve much worse than hate mail. Um, <laughs> Let's talk about something else. So Let's not. Ex- I'm all fucking pissed off. All right. All right. <laughs> We're done because I'm done talking to you. All right. All right Have bye. a good night, guys.